All right, and we're live. Good morning, everybody. Happy pre-4th of July. <laughs> Let me get my tweet out. I'm in the studio this morning with Karain and Yarnella. Good morning, everybody. Hello. All right, get the slideshow rolling. I think I got enough pictures from this week to roll for a two-hour slideshow, maybe more. Oh, that's cool. In fact, you know what? So everyone can see all the beautiful pictures. I may uh, crank up the settings here. <laughs> yeah, we've been yelling all over the place to add the hashtag LX. Yeah, that's awesome. Wow, it makes it so much easier to uh, get the show going. Mm -hmm. Hey, morning. Gio? Yes, sir. Um, I spoke to a, a, a German friend of mine that I met in-game. He streams as well. And uh, we're going to do something similar to what you guys are doing in German for the German community. Try and get it rolling. Oh, excellent, man. That's good. Awesome. But we're not going to be doing it like, you know, every day. We'll be doing it like maybe two times a week. We're going to, you know, we have five different shows we're going to be doing. So we'll have like one week doing something similar to the Morning Brew, going around looking at claims. And then we'll do Let's Talk, similar to, to you guys. And, and, you're do it, and you're going to do it in German. Fantastic, man! I have to That's brush awesome. up on my, I have to brush up on my German. <laughs> Seriously, I mean, I, I I worked in Germany off and on over the nineties. Uh, you could go be a guest. 2000s. Yeah, that's what I said. That's what I said to him. I goes, you know, we could we could basically go and get Gem, uh, Geo or Temma to come over to our show, and you know, be be part of it. Yeah. Oh, I well, think that's a great idea. Well, when you get it when you get it worked out, man, just let me know what the schedule is so we can promote the hell out of it. <laughs> Yep. And good morning, everybody out there. Hello, hello. Duchesne, hey, good morning. You finally get to watch the show live. Yeah, well, you know, we got an uh, early and short show today. I'm catching Terminator, uh, what is this? Genesis. So chronologically, it'd be Terminator 3. Because <laughs> that one Terminator <laughs> would be like Terminator 0. <laughs> am, I, am I wrong? Is that, is that, yeah, so. I have no idea. I saw the first one way back when, and I have not seen any of the rest. I guess I just like a different kind of movie. <laughs> oh, these are some nice shots. Yeah, these are actual screenshots that I took. You know, the Control F12, uh -huh. turning off the UI. So they're they're high resolution. They're they're, they're all these shots are yeah. HD. The stuff I, yeah. I scrape off of uh, Twitter is not HD, and it, there's two resolutions. If I just if I just right click on the pictures as it's as I'm scrolling down my feed, it's it's like a low res shot. I have no idea what the heck the resolution is, but it's not very good. And if I if I click on the picture and enlarge it, then there's a PNG dash large. And so I got to go, I got to take the backspace and I got to erase the word large so it actually saves as a PNG file. Otherwise, my computer has no idea what the hell it is. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I could probably fix that somewhere in my system, but. Probably, but yeah, but, that is finding it. Yeah, but but that is a higher res picture and looks and looks even better. But the stuff you're seeing right now, these happen to just coincidentally just happen to be the one, the screenshots I took from my computer. You see that t-shirt I linked to you, Gio? Say again? You see that t-shirt I linked to you? The t-shirt? Oh! Yeah, yeah, that's amazing. <laughs> yeah, I did. Uh, <laughs> I almost added it to the show, and I thought, you know, that, that's going to get misread. <laughs> it was, yeah, that was hilarious. My pen is bigger than yours. <laughs> I did see that. Oh, my I God. did see that. I that's liked it. That's Fun how a show. lot of those arguments feel. Yeah. Fun show <laughs> yesterday. Fun show, yeah, it was. man. Stella is just a she's a mad builder. Love what she does. Yeah, she does some really pretty stuff. We have met more interesting people through this adventure than any other thing I've done in my life. Mm-hmm. Except for maybe the five years I spent in the military academy. Let a I mean those are your formative years, so we made a lot of bonds there that 
you know, every time I see these folks, you know, 35, 40 years later, uh, wow, it, it's uh, it's like we never left. It just it still all, feels tight, yeah. We're just all fat and ugly now. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yeah, hey, it is what it is. <laughs> What I love, though, is how small this game made the world feel. You is know, there, yes, I made does, friends yeah. from all over the whole world that I just never thought would ever happen. And it just kind of proves to people if they would stop and pay attention that we're all just alike. I've, I've, traveled, I've traveled much of the world. Haven't been to Africa, Australia, or South America, but been in Russia. But have been almost damn everywhere else and uh it's cool to just meet all these these folks from places i've been to and places i want to go it is and what's amazing is the community here right you've got everybody from all over the world actually working together <clears throat> and if you if you compare this to all the other mmos that are out there with all the other countries they've got mixed basically and the way they you know talk to each other it's a completely different story compared to Landmark. Mm -hmm. We all get along here. We're all willing to help each other and everything. We're always friendly to each other. And that's just phenomenal. Yep, it's, it is. Yeah, it's incredible. It's setting a good precedent. It's just the nature of the game. It, yeah. It's just that simple. Yeah. It, you couldn't have done it with it. You know, EverQuest was, was cool. And we had. A, I was in a large guild that I started. Mm -hmm. and, and we had people from all over the world in the guild. But we didn't have this kind of closeness. No, e we didn't. And, yeah. And even and even if we had social media, we still wouldn't have had this kind of closeness because it's just landmarks just something cool, man. Folks, if you're out there and you're not in landmark, get in this game. Oh my God, it's so cool. It is. See, it's my the best. people are just great. Here we go. Well, I finally got my wife interested in landmark, so she's playing that as well. I heard. Oh, that's man. good. That's great. All right, the bot should be working. The bot should be live. Give it a whirl. I can keep my fingers off of all the keys. Yeah, it works. <laughs> <laughs> I just came by my claim for the sewer system, had a look at it, to give me some feedback. Yeah. And he did not like the spiders. <laughs> I placed down in the main room, I placed down like, I think it was and, eight spiders and they're all, they're all my, They just came across the screen, you guys will see it in, in ten seconds, five seconds. Oh my god. Dreadful. Dreadful dude. Dreadful. There it is. Oh. Awful. Yeah, I think Josh is just about done with the spiders. I, don't I am think too. Ever gonna, just, ever gonna look at my claim again? <laughs> just, just trying to be a good sport, but oh man. Yeah, but enough. Yeah, yeah. It's oh. time to to move on. We need to find something else, like fuzzy bunnies or something. Please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I agree. I agree. Especially after I saw that tweet from Druid's Fire yesterday. <laughs> you know, just telling everybody, okay, okay, guys, just back off. You know, yeah. I, that's well, I enough. I replied. And even Josh is going, oh, wow, I wish, <laughs> you know. And you can tell that he's trying to be nice and laugh about it, but he's done too. Yeah, uh, yeah. I tweeted back to her, that thanks for thanks for getting our six. Yes, I saw that. <laughs> <laughs> well, they could, you know, they could make life easier if they gave us, you know, a few monsters as props, what we could place down instead. <laughs> you know, get a chomper as a prop or an abomination. Yeah, man, I'm, those, I'm, then. I'm really, I'm really hoping. Yeah, because that's what I'm, that's, that's what I'm really looking for. Because when I'm, when I do my designing, I try and put down, you know, kind of indicators where, where, you know, where the monsters or a monster could stand and how, how it would look. And I'm having, I'm having basically, I have trouble getting a look and feel to it with an empty room of how a player and monsters would interact with each other inside, inside an area. And if I had a, you know, like a, a monster as a prop. I could, you know, get a better idea of what I'm trying to design here. Yeah, we we call them dummies. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> or a plushie. That's what. They oh, are oh the they, yeah, that's right there. You're right. Thank They're you, Carl. Plushies. Yeah. No, I would be the dummy. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I'm so glad we that uh, Aliana found Kalen's 
filled. That oh, is, me too. Wow. I never get tired of looking at that place. It's just it so is, pretty. It really is. It just really it really amazing. is. Yeah. Now, now uh, Tim says it to him. It looks ogreish. And I well, I see some textures and and a few shapes from the ogre. Basically, I think it was the shape that a couple of things had. But oh. hey, you know, it's a pillar for God's sakes. And it works though. It works. It looks amazing. It sure does. Yeah. It's yeah. It's got too much finery to be uh, too much detail to be. It's fancy. Yeah. Yeah. It's fa thank you, Carl. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, leave, it to, leave it to you to put it in a, into a word. Oh my God! We've I mean, been the nice th thing yeah. about the design is if you, you you know if you manipulate the color of the voxels or something like that, or you know move around, you can do so much with all those uh, pieces that he's uh, the design there. Yes, it's, it's amazing. I'm so glad. Uh, was it Kanake or Katake? Whatever, I can't remember the guy's name. Uh, did the dragon? I'm so glad he's got that back in the world. I wish he uh, had the rest of his his build back in the world. He he might have it, just not tagged. Well, did you what see the there? Did you see the look on Domino's face when we told her that there were over three thousand claims that were tagged in the gallery? No, I was probably busy trying to scan chat. I missed. It's you funny know what? What you miss in the conversation when you're trying to scan chat and keep track of. Who's asking what and and pulling questions for you guys for later, you know? And then I look over and oh my God, she's saying and that's how that is, you know? What what I miss the whole well, thing. It's well, it's the first time I had a chance to just to just sit and chit chat with her uh, since SWE Live, and yeah. so we talked uh, we talked for about ten minutes before the show kicked off and about maybe five minutes afterwards. It was a good time. So it's possible I may have made that comment then, but I thought it was during the show. Yeah, there's how many uh, of those? How many of those are, are you know empty claims? You got like any rough estimate on that? No, I, I don't. I, I don't. I don't think many are empty. I think the numbers cranked because people that have got like nine claims have tagged all nine of them oh, instead for sure. of just one. A lot of them take you to the whole thing, you know. But yeah, that's still a lot of claims, and and she never. You guys never asked her about more islands coming, so we never heard if there would be or wouldn't be, you know? Oh, yeah. I mean, there's, God, we have so, we have a ton of content for the next uh, show where we can get a developer on. Yeah. We've got so much stuff to talk about. It was good. God, what a great show. I watched it last night. It was really fun. So she was surprised when you said there were three, over 3,000. Yeah, she, yeah, she did. She had no idea. Now we're trying to guess the size of the active player base. Uh, that's really mm -hmm. hard to do now because, you know, one individual could have up to thirty-two claims. So, uh, just well, guess really, what the average is. You can only the say they're gonna they can have eight because it's only eight mains that you can put down. So you're only gonna be in eight places. Yeah, but they could, but they could tag. They could tag all thirty-two claims if they put well, them yes, all down. Well, yes, they could. Yeah, yeah so, they could. So trying to judge by what's in the gallery is really difficult. But I'm, I'm guessing. It's I'm almost guessing, like you should only be able to tag the main. I know yeah. that's how some people draw people to certain areas of the claim, but I don't know. It's just yeah, that's a lot of claims, and then you don't know where you are. Jim Seeker, good morning. Pet Hunter, what is happening, man? Pet Hunter, good morning, guys. Pet Hunter was streaming last night or yesterday, dude. Rock on, man. Great to see you on Twitch. Oh, that's awesome. I missed that. I will try yeah, to I catch get, it next time. Yeah, I, I gave him a follow, so good. Uh, I'll get the notifications when he's live. Yeah, Pet Man, if you got a uh, if you got a schedule worked out for your streaming, I, I don't know anything about your channel. I was only able to be in for a few minutes because I was out on my mobile. Pat Hunter, can you link your channel page so I can hit it with a follow and get notifications? Oh, you, you can you can just click you can just click on his name, and you should get the follow option. And that'll if he streams, that'll follow the channel. Yeah, that'll follow. Oh, okay, done. It's kind of the cool thing about Twitch. So if someone comes in the channel that uh, that, that streams, and we want to we want to give them a shout out, promote them. 
uh, then if we just, all I gotta do is just mention it. Have everyone click on their name, give them a follow. It's cool. Sweet. This is really starting to annoy me. You know, I'm, I have to click follow you. Yeah, the follow button for your morning brew now. I'm doing it now for the fourth time that I'm, you know, I always seem to get unfollowed. Dude, yeah, yeah. I was too the other day. Yeah. Not as often as that, but it's happening. So I, Crimcheck and I have followed each other for a long time, and and I went to his, I saw his tweet go out yesterday or last night about uh, they were going to do some FaceTime on Twitch. And I thought, oh, cool, man. It's late. I was getting ready to go to bed, but I just finished watching Spartacus, uh, the last of the last episode of the series, and and so I, I went to go watch the FaceTime, and I wasn't following him. It's like really, I remember pushing that button a long time ago. Yeah, it pops you off. I don't know why it pops you off, but it does. He and his wife are they're so funny. They were they were funny. They were like in rare form last night, man. They yeah. were chat they were chatty, yeah, they uh they got all kinds of plans there for promoting their, their channel and having fun. It was it was cool. Good morning, Bill. Morning. Oi mate. So, hey, is Firefly doing a talkish build? Grimstone, good morning, man. Cheers. I don't know if he is or not. So we got a short and early show today. I gotta be I gotta be out of the studio by 1030. Which is kind of a bummer, but uh, hey man. I got a, yeah, I got, well, I got a I got a big crew of people waiting for me, so yeah. you don't take off very often, so we'll let you go. <laughs> Thanks, K Firefly, oh. he's there. Yes, rock so on, man. So good, you've already got it in the competition. Sweet, sweet. It'll be good. fun starting those next week. Good morning, Zach. Wow, so Zach, the wife asked me uh, when the hell I'm going to cut my hair, <laughs> and I told her. Maybe with this Extra Life uh, event when it comes up. And she, there you she, go. She looks at me like, what the hell is that? <laughs> <laughs> really? But I think I'm not, I'm not going to shave it. I think I'm just going to get it uh, yeah, get it short. And I'm going to like dye it red, white, and blue or green or something. Oh, my God. <laughs> That'll work, yeah. Don't I, I can't see you shaving your head. But dyeing it red, white, and blue would be cool. Or something. Yeah, my my head's shaped like a harpoon. No, ogre's <laughs> not. No tattoos of a cow tar. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Dear. Yeah, if I get that those tattoos I've been wanting to get for a long time, um <clears throat> the wife will do a runner. <laughs> Yeah, really. <laughs> She'll put my stuff in the driveway. Oh, wow. Is that a pizza that just went by? I missed it. <laughs> yeah, they look really awesome. Yeah, they did. I wonder if the same person made those that made the hot dog and hamburger. I want a template of that hot dog and hamburger, though. So, GI, I noticed I can change the um, the resolution for the stream. Um, did Twitch finally give you props? What resolution options do you have? Uh, I can change from mobile to source now. On my show? Yes. Holy cow, man. So I, I think Twitch is finally recognizing you, dude. <laughs> the, uh, wow. Okay, I wonder... What does that mean? Well, you have to be partnered in order to provide multiple stream qualities to your viewers. But oh, maybe, sure. maybe there's been so much demand for mobile that uh, they're just doing this across the board. For, well, at least doing it for people that are, are subbed. I have a... 
I, I pay for most of my my Twitch accounts are all whatever whatever they call it paid. Yeah, they're paid accounts. Yeah, not freebies. Yeah, I can go mobile, low, medium, high, and source. And I was definitely not able to do that yesterday. <laughs> Interesting. Did Boy, a lot of people in the stream will be glad to hear that because a lot of people watch on their phone. No kidding, man. My wow, my uh, data plan. Oh, about that. <laughs> oh, TODs is seeing it too. So I guess uh, congratulations to you. <laughs> Could be. Uh, I don't Maybe know. I'm, it's I'm, in the mail. I don't I'm know. thinking that something has happened for everybody. Uh, well, let's just think that you're special because you are special. So you get that. <laughs> I read the short bus. Geo's moving up. <laughs> or sideways. <laughs> I, think, I, think it's a, I think it's a horizontal progression. <laughs> horizontal is still good. <laughs> All right. Well, let me, let me check my messages, see if I have a message from Twitch. All right. Oh man! Speaking of messages, I eleven, dude. I am sorry. We got to get out. We got to get out to go see uh, your PVP, man. Is eleven here? I don't know if he's here yet. I don't know. Let me look. Nope, not yet. No, guys. I've got no message from from Twitch, and uh, if you're not seeing a uh, option there to, um, I'm not. Uh, to sub to our channel, then we're not partnered, so they would do that. they wouldn't do that stealthily. So maybe it's just because uh, uh, I, I'm I'm subbed. Maybe maybe because it's I don't know. Maybe it's because it's a busy channel. Could be. Who knows? See, that's what I was thinking. I was I was thinking traffic wise. Yeah, they might be tagging the ones that are to see. You know how much more it's going to pull in. I don't know. Have to, have to do some research on that. To find out. Yeah, it'd be interesting. You know, but I see a lot of lately. people in the channel saying, "Oh, I'm gonna have to listen. I can't see it on my phone." Yeah, I have that trouble as well. I can only have audio on my mobile at the moment. Have you? Wow. You get. Well, give it a give it a try. See if uh, they've updated that. I can. You know, certain shows I can watch. But on my mobile, but some of them I can't. Typically, that would be people that are partnered. So I'm pulling it up now. Okay. Hey, BioXile, good morning, man. Oh, hi. Hey, Grimstone, that's awesome, dude. Yeah, we that man, we awesome. love we love what you made. Whoa, wow! Hey, on my mobile, I've got I've got source high, medium low, and mobile. Whoa, sweet! You're in business, man. Now you're gonna even be more addicted. I gotta send them a thank you letter, <laughs> or perhaps an extra payment. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, <clears throat> the invoice is in the mail. I'm sure. I don't know why, but thank you. Well, you know what? Now there's competition. Yep. See, they're going to have to step it up. That competition's a good thing, guys. It is. Free markets and all that. And I'm so logged in. I'm here at Jadams. Wow. I think the competition's why they're giving you the 12 second delay now. That could very well be. Because the other ones are already shorter. I'm enjoying the slideshow. It's it's so much fun. I got it, but we're gonna we're gonna cut it short and get to the show. We got some stuff to go see. And you got 25 minutes to do it. Stuff to search for. So let's uh, without further ado. And three, two, one. Yay! <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the morning brew. I'm Gio, live from Studio G, and we're here for the Fourth of July special on July 3rd. How about that? <laughs> I roar here. Yeah. Oh, and you know what we're missing? Dyfid and Pantera. Yeah. And, and Tina. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> Bio, Bio's <laughs> covered. Rock, brother. 
<clears throat> got it working as well, Jay, on my mobile now. You got it working on your mobile? Yep. That's cool, man. Well, I tell you what, you got to send a big thank you letter to Twitch. Definitely. I have to, I have to do that later today. That is that is fantastic. Wow. Maybe, uh, and we got to check Tenma's stream too. See if uh, he's got the same thing. Oh, Rez, no. <laughs> what's your <laughs> Rez? Set? No, no, I'm just zooming in. Send the thank you letter. Reply. We, we're sorry for the inconvenience. We made a mistake. <laughs> yeah, right. And that would be typical. <laughs> that would be yeah. par. For, that would be par for the course. <laughs> All right, man. Let me. Let's dig in. Let's dig into this. Uh, I want to. I want to wrap the show at Lousy's today, because uh, man, that Iwo Jima thing that he made is, dude. First time I saw that, my eyes started to well up. They're welling up just thinking about it. It's cool stuff. I got at uh, my all my father and both of his brothers served in World War II, and uh, so when I see any of that stuff, my old man served in the Army Air Corps. I uh, took uh, some heavy flak damage while uh, bombing Tokyo. Wound up crash landing in China captured got captured by this the platoon of chinese well they were chinese uh the chinese reds this is 1944 i mean there were these guys there were very few of them around but uh leading the platoon was none other than uh mao Zedong and cho and lai wow and he was with them for six months in the jungles of china there's nowhere to go Wow. So he didn't realize he didn't realize he was a prisoner until he tried to leave. <laughs> they put a gun, <laughs> they put a gun in his face. He's no, like, uh. So so uh, that night, man, his uh, he had he had to kill his tent mate to escape. Wow. This is someone he he oh. bunk, bunked with for six months. So uh, wow, and uh, he it was a long time before the old man was able to open up and tell me some of these stories, but. The story about Mao was just a jaw dropper. So he uh, he got home, quit the service. Uh, it's like 1945. Finally made it back, and just getting from China back to the U.S. That in itself was a whole Forrest Gump movie. Um, oh, I'll bet. And and then uh, in 1946, uh, when the Chinese Civil War started to heat up, and Mao was starting to gain a lot of power. Uh, a couple of MPs showed up at Harvard, where my old man was going to school. They pulled him out of uh, out of out of school, brought him back to the Pentagon. They uh, they debriefed him, then briefed him. Yep, tell <laughs> us what you know. Yep, and well, no, and then they put him on a freaking plane, flew him straight to China, and pushed him out with no, instructions <laughs> simple. With instructions simply, go find Mao, make contact. Oh, that was it, man. Seriously, I mean, that was. That was the way it was back then. Those guys were just <laughs> it's crazy. So I'm tooling around here at Jadams. I need to get I need to get on the roll on the ball here and stop stop yakking. Aqua Lab by Pain Masher. Oh, interesting. Oh man. Alright. Uh, you guys see what's on my screen? <laughs> yes! Oh my god. What? <laughs> there it is, man. Ah, oh, where is that rascal? Okay, so this is, you know, this has nothing to do with Independence Day. And I saw a oh, video. Oh, the Karen's up. Yes, I saw a video that someone someone I follow uh, linked out on, on Twitter of this uh, chap who went around to, uh, he was in San Diego, went to the beach, and he interviewed people to find out what they knew about Independence Day. And it was frightening. They knew absolutely nothing. <clears throat> yeah. Absolutely nothing. They were clueless. They had no idea. It was shameful. Upkeep management, and then I got one for my showcase. Oh, I just deleted it. Brilliant. All right. I have to find it on the, that lag. You'll get another one tomorrow. I don't worry about it. Good well, morning, you. Good morning, morning Zimnil. Zim. How are you? Fine with my coffee. Afternoon for me. <laughs> oh yeah, indeed, indeed. <laughs> oh, car. I love this. Statue. Oh, the Colossus. I made I'm it. I'm so glad it's back. All right, everybody, watch the clouds passing in front of the moon, and when I cross between the thresholds of the different biomes, the sky fast forwards and reverses. 
I guess that's, you, are you silly. Are you seeing that? In a that? minute. In a minute. And if possible, and you guys join us in TeamSpeak, if you have headphones, that would really help. Not a requirement, but uh, it'd be easier on, on uh, Push the Push to talk is a requirement. Yeah, it would be easier on the old man's ears. <laughs> Man, this is fantastic, Tenma. So he's probably not even awake. He was probably up late doing this. Yeah, he's not on yet. Oh, it's so good to see this back, though. This is just the coolest yeah. thing ever. Did he give you fly perms? Yeah, I was just going to ask. I'm just going to check. Oh, wait. No. That rascal. Oh, he's fired. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, indeed. No fly perms. You had one job. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you. All right. So, you know, I'm going to, instead of running up the inside, I'm going to, well, there's the, <laughs> well, there's the naughty bits. <laughs> we'll avoid those. <laughs> Oh man, I can't even grapple. God, please give us a big grapple look. One that works. Yeah, well, you know what? Since since all this gameplay stuff is not coming for a long time, hey, give us a little long grapple hook. You yeah. know? Totally. And there it is. Hello. Hello. There he is. Siphon. Good morning, Good morning. sir. Good morning. Sorry I'm late. Hey, David. 30 lashings with a wet noodle. Yep. Corrine will be on that. Uh, <laughs> brace yourself. <laughs> wow, this thing is, this is fantastic. I remember the night on the stream he started building this with the head that he had made to go on a gate in Alpha. So and he put the head down and started, yeah. Oh, Car, I had no idea there was a story behind it. Yeah, that head was is on the gate. That was in the the big city in Alpha that they built. The lethality. I didn't know either. Let me see if I can. And the biggest loincloth of landmark. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This guy is just beautiful. Oh yeah. And that it's copper on awesome. him just brought him to life. Wow, it looks really good, man. I'm so glad it was one of the winners for the Karen stuff. It needs to be in next. You need to be trudging through the woods and come across this. Thing. I know. Yeah. I I'm dead. I can't wait. You said you're dead? Zimno, what, what did you say? Indeed. Oh, indeed. We need this in EQN. Yeah. yeah. You look like a flea up there. Wow. Hi, Eowyn. Good afternoon, love. Hello, hello. And hello, everybody out there on Twitch. Glad you all could be here. We've got a short show today. Super short. Uh, I've just I got folks waiting for me. Going to go see the yeah. Terminator movie. I know. That seems so cool. This is how our guild got their name. Everybody was building Colossuses. <laughs> Oh, you we guys had were doing the this lizard. before. We had the lizard yes. going. Yes, yes, cool. I remember that made thing. the lizard, and then we had this guy, and and Cody was making the the dwarf, dwarf? and and um, Spider had the the high elf. Remember the beautiful high elf that's still in progress. Oh, oh yeah, wow. And this thing is seriously cool. And all it right. was getting to be a joke about the, all the colossuses that were being built, and then the guild came out, and then oh, that's what we're gonna call it. So it worked pretty good. Hmm. There's Doyfed. Good morning. And Spooty and 80 were making one too, yeah. Good picture. And then too. Ogre Snot built the cow tar. <laughs> Ruined it all. <laughs> <laughs> Scarred I forever. love your cow tar. All right, so let's try this by searching military. See what we get. Hey, Takish government building. <laughs> Come on, <laughs> awesome. It's great. Takish government military castle. So it's not really related to Independence Day, but hey, you know, <clears throat> let's go see it. So happy day before Independence Day to everybody out here in the states. Uh, nice. 
Uh, for those that don't know what uh, American Independence Day is all about, uh, in 1776, we declared our independence from England, from the tyrannical King George III, who I'm actually, actually named after. It's dreadful. I'm George George III. I don't know what was wrong That's with my so parents. Vegas. I have no idea. Yeah. And then there was the benevolent... Down with the red coats. <laughs> the, the, the benevolent George IV, who my son is named after. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> but I got... I I got I got the crazy king. Uh, so uh, they were, uh, well, it was a very oppressive time, <laughs> especially if, uh, well, and we we were getting taxed without representation in parliament. And that led to the Tea Party, the Boston Tea Party and the revolt. And it just, it just started from there. And uh, George Washington led our war for independence, became our first president. So that video, I if I, it's out there on Twi on Twitter. Uh, but this guy, and I can't remember his name off the top of my head. I've never seen him before. But he's got this little funny, quirky TV show thing he does on YouTube. And he was out there interviewing people. I mean, just real interviews. He's out there. He's got his cameraman and his microphone. And he's asking people uh, uh, if they you know know about Independence Day or know the, the history of Independence Day or what we declared independence from or who. And no one he talked to knew. They had to <laughs> that some thought it was independence from uh, Mexico. <laughs> it's a, it's really? Yes. Uh, <clears throat> the oppressive Mexicans. <clears throat> anyway, if you find that video, it's it's hilarious. I know a lot of Americans will mix up Independence Day and Memorial Day. Yes, Memorial Day is where we honor. Everybody who has served in our military. Freedom. Actually, we, <clears throat> huh? Actually, that's Veterans Day. Memorial Day is that's, the day we right. There's honor too, too the people many days. given Just, their lives in defense well, of the country. Yeah. Yes, yes, thank you. And then Labor Day. Memorial Day and Labor Day uh, mark the beginning and end of the uh, swimming summer. pool season yeah. <laughs> in America. <laughs> That's what they are. Oh, you know, the beginning of summer. School opens on that day. Barbecue School season. School closes on that yeah, day. Yeah, barbecue season for sure. I'm liking this building, man. This is cool. Yeah, Talkish, this is pretty. Talkish Government Center. So, question is, is he pretty going square, to... square, though. Is he going to destroy it? Ooh. Yeah, if he's going, to, well, if he's going to blow it well, up, well, they have to. Won't matter. But it's it's pretty. I like this. It's very pretty. He doesn't. But that's have, what they want, right? Yeah. It's like a full building like this, and then a destroyed version. I think so. Different levels of destroyed. Quick, sir. Good morning, man. George the Third wasn't so bad. He was a he was a crazy one. Well, you know, that's the uh, that's the one that uh, Jack Sparrow had to deal with. So. Thanks, Zach. <laughs> Sack, yeah, happy 239th birthday. Wow. Fubar, welcome, man. I know, the floor pattern's pretty cool. Luciflex, good morning. Well, let me let me greet everybody here in TeamSpeak. I'm here with Karain, our fabulous moderator. Thank you for being here every day, Karain, you rock. Oh, you're welcome. Except when I oversleep, huh? <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. It's occasional. Damn arc. You're retired. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I am retired. I can sleep in if I want. It's allowed. <laughs> and David, speaking of uh, speaking of retired, <laughs> 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 how are you, man? I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> and uh, oh, hey, and look who just showed up, man. Tim, what's up, brother? What's up? We were just good visiting morning. your Karen Colossus. That thing was, I saw its picture in the gallery. <laughs> the Colossus just looks beautiful. Like Dude, beautiful. that thing's amazing, man. Thank you for putting that back in the world. The world just feels more right now. <laughs> I think he's getting his juice. <laughs> BioXL, good morning, man. How are you? Doing good. Glad you're here, dude. Wow. I wasn't so sure if I was. 
<laughs> you weren't sure if you were, yeah, well. Ark is killing coffee. us. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. well, that, <laughs> we're all on way too fun. late. You just get started, <laughs> you just can't freaking stop. <laughs> well, Villionaire, are you playing Ark also? I am not, sir. Oh, wow. Well, at least there's, at least there's one more of us who's not. <laughs> just, it seems like it's just you and me. <laughs> no, I'm not either. Oh, okay. Well, all right. Well, then we got a crew. That's good. Team No Ark. Yeah, yeah Team No Ark. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Zimno, good morning. <laughs> Good morning. How are you, love? I'm okay. I'm just doing some bases for that big plaza you visited uh, some days ago. Nice. So, nice. Time to decorate those big yeah. bases. Get them ready. And Grimstone, good Thank morning, you. man. Welcome back. It is good to see you, brother. He's, he might be getting coffee or, yeah, could be. or looking for his on button. Because <laughs> he's, he's there in Lord. chat. Hello, Grimstone. And out here in in, uh, in Twitch with us in Twitch land, Abel. Good morning, love. Aowen, billionaire, billionaire, Butchy Wolf, Bio Exile, Draco's Guth, uh, Duchesne, Duchesne 36, uh, Fubar, Firefly Whisperer, Gym Seekers, Grimstone, uh, Clusty. Hello there. Uh, Lochnar Rules, uh, Luciflex, Magic Phoenix. Lomlo, hey man, welcome back. Lomlo, it's been a while. Nice to see you. Uh, Nordy, Nordy Hepburn, <laughs> welcome man. Uh, Ogre Snod, Peter Marinez, Pet Hunter, Qu uh, Quixar, hello man. Raz 651, Shatari, TODs, Virgigorn, Zexadu, Zimnal, and last but not least, Zylena. Good morning, everybody. Well, we are we're doing a, a short, quick show today. Uh, because, of course, July 4th falls this year on a Saturday, so uh, we'll, we'll be out. I'll be at Arlington Cemetery in the morning. Um, but next up, guys, let's go to uh, Aria Sphinx's claim here. And we want to wrap over at Lousy's. Hi, Grim. Grim, are you there, lad? He's in team speak. But he's not speaking. <laughs> it's okay. There, there, I heard him. Smack! <laughs> Swinging the microphone over his head. When I am the, here. When does hey, the world, there he is. end of the world movie coming out? In a while, Quasar. We're working on it. Yeah, He's it's getting there. So we uh, we got this thing put together, and then realized that it needed it needed the the, the attention and love and care you want to give to something really special because. Wow, we we got this thing pieced together, the first part of it, and and realized it was something much greater than the sum of its parts. So we have brought in, uh, well, brought in Ben Pickerel, who is Zinrath, uh, and he made the Axeman video. And man, this guy is—he's uh, an audio specialist. A, a he makes he does film in real life. He's moving to Hollywood. Actually, he's moving to Los Angeles this week. And he's assisting with the uh, special effects and voiceovers, and also with the uh, final editing of the of the film. So it's looking really, really, really good. And then yeah, got... it's going to be so worth it. I just know when you sent the first clips, it it was cute and it was nice. You know, nothing was really put together yet, but right. you had it kind of in a running order. Right. Right. And that's kind of, I think, what people are expecting to see. But by the time you sent me the last iteration that you guys had done, and I haven't even seen the voiceovers in there yet, you guys are just going to be blown out of the water. It has changed so much. It's so much more than it was when it started. It, yeah, it is. Wow. <laughs> it's bloody amazing. It is. It's hard it will to be believe, well worth the wait. It's hard to believe that we've been able to capture footage like that from a video game. Which is what's so cool. So, uh, the one of the things that we're missing is uh, a lot of audio sounds to enhance the situation. So you see all the machines. Since we don't have the ability to add audio to the game yet, uh, we're, we we got to do that in post production. So when they're in the the mech hangar, for example, uh, get the mechs ready for combat to go out there to tackle that white monster, we need machine sound mach machine sounds in the machine shop in the in the uh, mech hangar. You know, change tongue twister. Yeah. yeah. There's so many little things you don't realize that you need to add to keep your brain 
in that realistic click, you know? So we are here at Diamond Beards, who is, uh, he re retooled his, his character and his new name is Aria Sphinx. And man, this is his, uh, this is his, his force. There's his tank made of props, that thing. Oh my God, that, that is just amazing. Here's his original M1 Abrams that we just marveled over. This thing was amazing. This is all, this is mostly voxels with a few props added to it. Uh, but here he, uh, man, he just did it right. This is pure props, nothing but props. Might be, might be voxels in the, uh, f inside the frame just so you can rotate it properly. And then of course he used the starter building. He makes beautiful vehicles. Yeah, he does. And, and you know what's interesting is, is he's not a, wasn't in the military. Uh, he's a um, he's a CAD specialist, does three uh, D three uh, D modeling design. Um, but this man, this is just awesome stuff. Well, Arias, we salute you, man. Good job here. Thank you for leaving this claim down in the world. I'm not There's sure he's here today. There's stuff up the uh, hill there too, that also looks in theme. Up the hill. Wow. Keep an eye on the clock, Gia. Northeast. Yeah. yeah, we may not have time to, to squirrel. Yeah, you're running out. You sure? Because there's a giant American flag up there. Oh, hey, well, look, you know what that is? That's where we're going next anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. This is Ferd, Ferd Burfel's USO base. Oh, it is. I love that place. <laughs> And light change. I'm waiting for it. Chasing Tagger, man. Good morning. Welcome to the show, mate. Arlington Consumer's website is offline at the moment. Oh, that's not good. She Quicksar says that. He thinks the machinima possibilities in this game are limitless, and he was thinking that you could use it to make a graphic novel also. Dude, you're spot on. That's, I think, something that we can do from from what we've made for the movie itself. I've got lots of, lots of great ideas, and now that we have the green screen capability in here so we can do compositing, it's going to make compositing so much easier. Folks, we are over here at Ferd Burfels. I love this guy. He's love uh, this place. He and he's not here today, but uh, uh, Ferd was uh, well. He's in Colossus Prime, and he was a Navy SEAL. He is since yeah. retired, and uh, well, he's still a Navy SEAL. <laughs> he's still a Navy SEAL. Yeah. He is. He is so funny. But uh, he is. He is one of the. I don't know. One of the valued friends I've made. Starting, uh, starting landmark. This is what we were talking about at the beginning of the show while the slideshow was going. Yeah. So we just made connections here from all over the world, oh. though. Let's get this right. He's a Navy squid. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, lovely. All right then. <laughs> I'll let you take that up with him. <laughs> oh, Pure I do. Here. Yeah, I bet. I'm sure you do, man. So this POW MIA sign was made by uh, our good friend Talon Hawk, who's in Legendary Explorers with us. He uh, he's got connections there, so he's got a whole backstory. And if he was here, I'd let him tell it. But he did a marvelous job with this. He did. And who made this American flag? I don't. Do we, know. Do we know who crafted this? It might have been one that he got from um, Lady Kathleen's. Yeah, I, I know I've got, I think I've got two American flags in my collection. Um, this is beautiful. Got the Hueys it there. Is. And then, uh, and then all the aircraft were provided by Bomb Diggity. Thank you, man. Good old Bomb. <laughs> yeah, he makes cool stuff. <clears throat> well, this is, this is our party base. We come here to hang out. Uh, and of course, this is when we're shooting the movie. This is, well, this was doubled as the actor's lounge. <laughs> <laughs> I prefer it even more as a USO base. Just awesome. There's an uh, FY7, FY17 up there. It's still fighter with the... Uh, Especially it's in an old hangar building and yeah, it yeah, just fits. Gotta love it. 
All right, so, uh, man, I'm close to my deadline. Holy crap. Yes, you are. Um, there's stone points, atomic coast garter. So, and there's, uh, there's Lousy's Memorial Day claim. So, let's go over here to hit Old Glory by Sneak Hair. Uh, Sneak Hair is Sleek Hair. If you follow her on Twitter, uh, if you don't follow her, you should. She is the representative in Landmark for MilitaryGamers.com. They are a fabulous outfit. Tim and I met these guys at SOE Live. And, man, they are just good people, salt of the earth. Mm -hmm. And they're there to help uh, military vets who are, well, self-medicating through gaming, basically. And, good. And there's, uh, well... You guys know who you are. There's a lot of you who do it. And uh, and they're there as a support group uh, to either just hang out with, go play games with, or uh, if you if you really need uh, need to contact somebody, man, don't hesitate. Hit their website, militarygamers.com, and feel free to contact Sleek Hair in-game. She is on in Landmark very regularly. Now, and Tim, do you know if, if Sleek was at SOE Live? Did we meet her there? Uh, off the top of my head, I don't remember meeting her there, but um, there was, I know, three guys that I spent with uh, time with there at their booth for quite some time. I was trying to get connectivity to get our uh, our interview with Dave Georgeson that we did there at SOE Live uploaded. Thanks, Seth. And- and uh, Omid wouldn't give me the time of day, so uh, I went over to militarygamers.com, and these guys hooked us up. So very grateful, very very grateful. I still don't like Omid. <laughs> yeah. Good morning. Good morning. I like I this. I've been working this morning very hard. <laughs> morning. <laughs> yeah, well, it's nice to see you. This is beautiful. This is this flag is by Sleek Hair. She has done such a great job, and she got the she joined us with our uh, Veterans Day special, which was an amazing episode. You can find it on uh, I think both on our YouTube channel, but definitely you can find it right here on Twitch. Wow, that is just amazing. Yeah, that's nice. What other countries? actually observe the 4th of July besides the United States well England should <laughs> that's the day good riddance day, day. Good riddance day. I, I'm pretty I'm pretty sure that uh, Brian would say oh heck no yeah, <laughs> yeah I'm sure man <clears throat> well it was the day we told King George the third to uh, bloody stuff kiss it. off stuff it <laughs> get stuffed <clears throat> All right, folks, funny. I'm running over. Uh, I've got some folks waiting for me, but we are going to close the show today. Oh. I know. We're going to close the show today. Well, Tim, are you up for picking up the stream early? Yeah, well, sort of. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that'd be fantastic if you could, man. Uh, Doesn't he sound should... ready? <laughs> not really. <laughs> well, I forgot my bloody coffee, and Lousy's not. Oh, he's probably asleep. Oh, too bad. I was hoping he'd be here in, be here in time. Mm. All right, so we're going to Lousy's Memorial Day claim. Yeah. So no, my, how, my how short are you cutting it today? This is it. I'm I'm on for two, three more minutes. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good morning, Tom. Get to work. Get online. <laughs> Well, let me let me get my face on and and, and we will do this. <laughs> that sounded like slap. Go to work. <laughs> rolling, rolling, rolling. Get them doggies rolling. <laughs> Where are the, what other ways can you give your favorite TV show abuse like that? And yeah. have it sound time. You know. Yep. Live. Great. See, Twitch. I'm worn out because I, I stayed up all last night trying to get that uh, Karen back up. <laughs> That's what we figured when I didn't see you this morning when the show started. I figured you were out there getting the Karen rolling. Oh, is that what you were doing last night? He is just beautiful. God, yes. It was so good to see him back. And thank well, you for yeah, being him came back. 
Well, considering I had someone who sent me like a poop ton of um, copper. Copper. copper, good, <laughs> and had been requested multiple times to get that back up, and including by Geo, because you know. Mm -hmm. So I I figured you know what, screw this. So I took down my workshop that I've been doing most of the streams in. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And replanted them over where they're located right now. Yeah, he's beautiful. It was very good to see him back. I'll have to log in and go look. This thing brings tears to my eyes. Lousy dude. God bless you, brother. Thank you for this making this. This is beautiful. This. Yep. Thank you for making this. And I will say, 1.6 million copper. <laughs> copper on that. Well, we kicked off the show at that Goodness. thing, man. So, well, well, everybody, have a fabulous July 4th weekend. Uh, be safe. You too, Gio. Enjoy some fireworks, some good company, brew, the whole works. And Enjoy. Uh, have a good time with your kids. I will. And uh, Tinma's up next. <laughs> He's going to, uh, well, do whatever Tinma does when um, I surprise him. <laughs> He's got to go early. <laughs> <laughs> so, brother, thank you, man. Thank you for covering my six here. I appreciate it. And uh, everybody, have a great, just a fabulous weekend. Any community build this weekend? Yes, there will be one uh, this weekend. Um, as soon as I finish the show, which I'll be doing a short show too, just because it is... You know that weekend type thing but um my butt's headed back home again and uh my best friend came down uh so I, I'm, I get to go see him and i haven't seen him in god nine years now wow wow that's, dude, oh, that's, that's awesome so cool. that time that'd be great you get to go see him that is so cool well, everybody, be good out there. Tim is up next, and uh, so just stay tuned. And uh, Carr will forward the channel to to Tim's channel. And yep. uh, man, have a great weekend, everybody. Go out there and build something. Bye, everybody. Goodbye. See you Monday. Bye. 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 -bye. Or that's it. <laughs> Show's over. <laughs> have fun, Gio. <laughs> Enjoy your movie, Gio. Bye. Everybody. Cheers, everybody. <laughs>